Jimmy Guns here, and you're tuned in to Canadian Cards. Enjoy. What's going on, guys? Mike here from Canadian Cards. Thought I'd just pick up one of these uh, 2019 2020 Upper Deck Series 1 tins. Uh, what do we get in here? I think we get um, 8 cards per pack, 10 packs. I think one of them is uh, like a, I don't know, limited pack or something. Sorry, I almost knocked my camera over. Hope you guys are doing well. I want to wish all my American YouTube subscribers a very happy Thanksgiving. Um, so let's uh, let's crack this open and see what we get. Okay, so there's the bonus pack, the funky pack. What are they doing here? Normally they don't do that. That's odd. They do it that way. But it is what it is. I'll just kind of set that off. I'm actually going to uh, just lower my camera here, guys. So, I think we'll uh, save that one for the end. See how we do here. So we got two, four, six, eight, nine, and the bonus pack is ten. So, without any further ado. I know I should probably be ripping football, seeing as today is all about football in the U.S. So I'm just going to go through these quick and see if I get anything. Upper Deck Prospect, Elias Peterson. Uh, that's nothing. Don't expect a lot out of these, these tins. Um, actually, I can't remember if I said my daughter was at Walmart she sent me a picture she said you want one of these and I said sure a lovely gesture by my daughter she uh, she always when she's always at Walmart shopping she's always looking and saying hey do you know this is out or and I'm like yeah oh we got a canvas card so this is good who do we got Brock Besser very cool canvas checklist card yeah I'm not expecting much of anything out of these um, hopefully we get a young gun maybe two be nice um, but <clears throat> And obviously, we're looking for the uh, Jack or Quinn Hughes. Be quite honest, I want the Mikhailov from Toronto. He's a young guy. There is Marasmus Sandin. So, although I got a Toronto one, I got the wrong one. Well, he's big up here, so that's a good one. Try Seidel. That's the next, uh, the next couple of young guns I'm looking to pick up are uh, Dreisaitl of Edmonton. But man, his prices are just soaring. And also uh, David Posternock from Boston. Carter Hart, even though I hate with a passion the Boston Bruins, I do respect talent and... Uh, that guy's got it. That's for darn sure. So, hopefully, uh, I can get one on a good price. Uh, was even looking at the last show I was at, hoping to pick one up raw. But um, another canvas, Pavel Buknevich. Kovalchuk, he's having a terrible year. I think he's going to be retired. Or drop. I think he's already been a healthy scratch a few times. If you guys follow, I know most of my uh, most of my followers don't um, don't do a lot of hockey. Some do, but most don't, and that's okay. It's not for everyone. It's uh, you know, collect what you like. I love baseball, but I like hockey. I like football too. Basketball, meh. 
I get caught up in the hype the odd time, but nothing major. I should have uh, had a show. Some guy had some PSA 10 Lucas. He had two of the regular prisms. I think he wanted 300 Canadian. He had the red, white, and blue for 500 Canadian. I don't know if that's a good deal or not. So it looks like, oh, another one. Philippe Myers from Philly. Don't know enough about him. A lot of these guys, you know, they become, uh, they show up in the young guns and uh, they end up being, you know, flashes in the pan. So let's check this out. Let's see what we get. These are, uh, oh, looks like, no, these are all OPG versions. So we have Dante Fabro. It's not bad. Philip Zadina looks like a gold, or is that a what do they call it? Gold or platinum or bronze? I don't know. And a Trent Federick. Is this a guy from Boston College? I'm not too sure. Did play for Providence, so maybe not. But yeah. There you have it, guys. 2019-2020 Upper Deck Series 1. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Again, have a safe and happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy football. And uh, just be thankful for your health, family, friends, and happiness. Okay, guys? Take care.